Champlain Parkway project taking a big step forward and being completed. This project has been 50 years in the making. Eventually, it's going to connect Burlington's south end to I-189. NBC5 Sid Boulay is live at the intersection near Burlington's city market with the very latest on this. Sid. Brian, this section of the parkway is open now. It has been a long journey to get here. And as I've been here in the past couple hours, seeing plenty of cars, pedestrians, and people riding bicycles taking advantage of the new route. Two, three. After more than 50 years, the Queen City opening the first leg of the Champlain Parkway from Home Avenue to Lakeside Avenue. We're here to really start to celebrate a generational project of the Champlain Parkway. It's a project that was first envisioned before many of us were even born and is now a few steps closer to being completed. Commuters can use the first portion of the parkway in Burlington's South End after decades of delays and a complete reimagining. This project was right-sized from a high-speed, four-lane divided highway to what you see today behind us, which is a two-lane, slow-speed city street with green infrastructure and a robust bike and pedestrian accommodations, which you can see right here. In total, the parkway will be close to three miles in length and connect to I-189. Something that VTRAN says opens up Burlington South End for future development with the help of federal partners. Had it been built 20, 30 years ago, you would not see what you have today. And this is so much more appropriate for the community, for the city, for all of us that will use this roadway. So congratulations, job well done. And local businesses and neighbors welcoming improved access for customers and all that the South End has to offer. City Market took a big risk um, moving our second location here um, with the promise in the background from the city that they would commit on this decade long um, promise of the new co corridor. So we're so excited to see it finally happen. Construction for the remaining part of this project is expected to kick off either in September or at the latest by early October, with the full parkway expected to open sometime next year. Live in Burlington, Sid Buley, NBC5 News.